Try some. Mmm. Dude, look at that sunrise. Freaking beautiful. Good morning, folks, and welcome back to Baiting Van Fishing. Today, we are back on the ice. It's January ice fishing, and guys, we want to catch some crappies. We, had a, we are at a lake that I fished before, and uh, this time around, um, this year, this season, I actually haven't been out here yet, but uh, gonna get all the stuff loaded. Solo mission, just me today, guys, and uh, we'll see you guys on the ice. Let's go. Plan is to uh, obviously catch some crappies. Hopefully we can stumble into a morning bite after we get that done with. Maybe in the uh, later afternoon, we can transition to some uh, bass and pike with the underwater camera if uh, water clarity allows us to. But uh, guys, let's get freaking fishing. I'm excited. to be little fish at the bottom hopefully you guys can see it on camera time right now is pretty much eight o'clock it is trout opener too as well but i always buy my trout license every year and never end up using it oh something's coming up by the way these fish are reacting wow do have a large selection of lures to use such as uh, live bait, spikes, minnows. You guys can see here, go tongue still and Google eye with a wedge on the back. Pink wedge. Let's put on some meat. Penetrate the spike like so. See if that can entice a bite, guys. Okay. Fish appears to be still down there, right at the bottom. Don't appear to be too big, but you know, we're now we are sitting in 14 feet of water. We could, you know, potentially draw in more fish. You know, doesn't appear like there's a lot of people on the ice today for uh, panfish. Everyone's out fishing trout ponds and stuff little fish dude there's a bluegill I bet dang these are just bluegills guys <laughs> bluegill should have known it but anyways broke the skunk first fish of the day little fella now I know how to gauge his size on the scope these are all small fish so find something that's more exciting than this so let's go ahead and cover water now we know what the heck we're dealing with these are not the appropriate size we want so how do we do that well start by drilling some more holes guys time is currently 9 27 still have not yet to catch our first crappie but hopefully you guys can see on live scope we are in 31 feet of water does appear to be fish underneath us crappies i assume right now we have a jig with just some spikes on it hopefully we get bit coming up come on big mark is coming through come on smoke it buddy there we go fish on he was like a crappie, guys. Yes, sir. Good eater size. There you go. Show you guys that. Hell yeah. Not super monstrous, but dude, that's a grind. Finally got our first crappie of the day, boys. Look at that. The other marks down there don't 
appear to be much bigger than this so but if we can stay on top of them and if they don't move we should be able to get some good tasting fish oh they are coming up another one fired up the school come on There you go, baby. Crappie number two. Dude. Hell yeah, buddy. Hell yeah. <laughs> this feels good. <laughs> Let's go, baby. There you go. Damn, this guy feels pretty big. Oh, this is a freaking tank, guys. Guaranteed, this is a big end. This is gonna be a big end, dude. I've used fish all day. Oh, just like that. Hell yeah. Fish number three. Hell yeah. That, guys. Hell yeah. Made the right choice of leaving that dumb school that wasn't gonna bite no more. This school is way bigger, way bigger, more aggressive. Oh, yeah! There you go. Oh, again, hooked up. These are all quality crappies, guys. Oh, just came right off, came right off. There you go, hooked up again. He's like the same size. Oh yeah, dude! Oh! Oh! Hell yeah! Fish number five! Oh! Let's go! Catching crop ass, finally! This is fish number four, I think. Just like that. It's a gold jig with tons of spikes on it. Doing dirt, bruh. Send up down there. Here we go. Smoked it. Looks like a big one. Come on, don't come off. Come on, don't come off. Ooh. Biggest of the day so far, dudes. Oh, for the tank. This guy was aggressive. PB of the season. Solid 11. Take that. That was sick. Guys, we are finally back home from fishing. We got the boys over, Everly right there, mom Hi. washing the dishes, and we got some fabulous food they've been cooking already. So uh, that's Bombay there, but we will be cooking our crappie soup. But today, overall fishing, absolutely super fun. Caught a lot of fish on the small spoon and the tungsten with those spikes, and it was just lights out. We got our fish right here. House is extremely dirty from cooking, so excuse that. Check out those babies. How are we gonna cook them? We're, we're gonna cook them the easy way. Fillet them, deep fry them, eat them. So it's gonna be a good one. Let's go ahead and uh, start cooking and I'll uh, see you when we're done. Let's go. And before we actually kick off there, you already know what you gotta drink after a long freaking day of fishing, guys. Refreshing, I tell you. Mmm, delicious. Okay, so the camera is rolling. Just filleted nine crappies 
sorry for the hair. We got guests over, so if there's background noise, just go ahead and uh, ignore that. But we have our oil cooking right here, as y'all can see. Uh, once it gets hot enough, we're gonna batter our crappies, the fillets, and basically cook them. And hopefully if it's cooked, we're gonna have the boys try it. And if it's good, they'll let me know. I'm excited to try it though. I haven't done this in, I think, a year, to be honest. So um, let me show you guys what I have planned. So here's what we got planned, guys. We are mixing these two together. Just regular stuff you can get at like Cup Foods and stuff right here, yeah? And then over here, bread crumbs. So mix it together. You don't really know if it's gonna do good, but we'll see what happens. Let me know your recipe or any advice. I am not a chef by all means, but it's all about trying, folks. Yeah, look at it. Yeah, yeah, so flour, eggs, and then the thing Like that, guys. Okay, 235, let's go. Try some of the fish from earlier. Okay. It looks cooked because it's flaky. Tastes like fish. Mm. Tastes like freaking fish. Want to try some, Timothy? Tastes like fish. Want to try some? This is now. Do you use my batter? I don't smell anything. I'm letting it sit until I see the uh, crumbs begin to burn. Once it starts burning, then we know it's good. It might just taste like the chicken. Pretty much. Did you salt it? No salt. Why? Actually, no, they're not. Salt it and put black pepper on it. Oh, there's chicken here. I didn't know I was supposed to do that. I mean, it's gonna taste so bland. It's fine. Let's try some. Mmm! Scrumptious. Mmm. Ah. Mmm. Mmm. The breadcrumb. Mmm. Ah, oh, so good. Killa. Be honest. It's good. It's good? Mm -hmm. Alright. My? Let's see. Oh shoot, I have my image line. <laughs> oh, I gotta yeah. cancel then? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, do that. Awesome. Honest review? Yes, sir. It's like fish, right? Yeah. Timothy? Yeah. It's going to do great things in 2023. But I know I'm here to compete in the He's like fish, huh? Mm-hmm. Kevin? I'm more like a fish guy, so I'm probably like this. Oh, good. Good, huh? But guys, finally done for the day. Done cooking, done fishing, house a mess. Tons of dishes to wash, but uh, thank you again for getting all the way till the end here. Who knows what we're gonna do next week. More crappie fishing, let me know what you guys think. But I have fun today, hope you guys did too. Caught a lot of fish, haven't caught fish in a while, but cheers! Mm. I think it would taste better with like pepper, you know what I'm saying? A better sauce. But other than that guys, thank you for watching, and I will see ya on the next one. Peace out.